Shut up and sit down. Uh, Matt, let's go back to the, the small track days, right, where it all began. Tell us about the beginning. You know, I guess we're going to go way back. My uh, my dad, my dad's three brothers raced at Jefferson Speedway. That was the closest track to our house. Uh, Saturday nights, we'd sit up on the hill at Jefferson with, um, you know, my grandparents and my aunts would be up there watching my uncle's race and uh, my cousins would be up there and stuff. So just kind of started doing that and hanging out and just that's kind of where where it all started. And then uh, one year after the championship race, uh, we were driving home and my dad did a U-turn and went back to the track. I kind of asked him what he was doing. He said he was going to go back and buy a race car. And uh, my dad was real funny. He's like, I'm going to buy it there. I'm going to have him drop it off at the house because I don't trust him not to take good parts off or change the setup or whatever he thought they were going to do. So anyway, the, he went and bought a car right out of the pits after the last race. And the guy dropped it off at our shop. And we didn't have any tools. Neither one of us knew how to work on anything. We didn't have a trailer. Um, we didn't have anything. And um, I, was, uh, I was 12 or 13 at the time. And uh, really, that's where it all started. We went to... Uh, local farm fleet and bought bought a jack and some jack stands and a toolbox and started buying some tools here and there and um, I pretty much did all the work on the car and my dad drove it for the first uh, few years uh, until I turned 16 and I got a a car and we both raced at the same time for a little while but that's kind of where it all started was uh, was Jefferson Speedway actually when I started I started racing at Columbus Speedway uh, which isn't there anymore and uh, because that was a Friday night that my dad would race Saturday nights at Jefferson so I could work on his car wow Fun. Shut up and sit down.